Hello and welcome to another Tuesday Tip. I'm Deanna Baker, Lead Voucher Specialist at Navigate Affordable Housing Partners. Today we're going to be talking about your contract rent effective date and your utility allowance effective date. When you have a rent schedule with two different effective dates, you want to ensure that you use the proper date when applying your rents. Your contract rent will be effective on the date listed at the upper right corner of your rent schedule. If the utility allowance date differs from the contract rent, you want to ensure that you enter your utility allowances on that effective date. This will require a two-part entry into your software in order for the adjustments to generate properly. Failing to enter the rents correctly under the appropriate effective date will cause errors on every certification we receive and will require us to reject your voucher and request corrections. When you make an error entering the date, it affects every certification in your system. You will need to correct every certification that has the wrong rent in order to make it work. This is a lot of work and usually requires you having to call your software provider. That's why it's so important to make sure that you use the proper effective date in cases when the contract rent effective date is different than the utility allowance effective date. If you have questions about your rent schedule and the proper effective date, please don't hesitate to call your voucher specialist. You'll find that information on the Navigate website. Thanks so much and have a great day.